Hello, I'm Joe Holder from CBS3 in Philadelphia. Let's start with a look at the forecast with meteorologist Lauren Casey. Thanks, Joe. We had a line of severe thunderstorms work across the area. Much of that activity has moved out, but we could see a lingering hit or miss thunderstorm early tonight. Otherwise, partly cloudy, warm and muggy with a low temperature at 72. We get some relief as we head into the day tomorrow. Sunshine breezy, a straight afternoon shower turning much less humid with a high temperature cooler down to 86. Feeling great all Monday. We wake up to 63 degrees, comfortable humidity, sunshine with a high of 85, but the heat and humidity Humidity return as we head into Tuesday. A morning shower with a warm front, then getting steamy once again. We're up into the low 90s by Wednesday with a pop up afternoon thunderstorm and looking hot and humid for the 4th of July holiday. Joe on next Thursday with a high of 93. Lauren, thank you. Hahnemann University Hospital says it is no longer accepting trauma patients. The move comes after the Center City Institution announced this week it is closing. Eyewitness News has learned that even though the hospital won't take trauma patients anymore, the ER will remain open for minor injuries and illnesses. Hahnemann's parent company says it is shutting down the 496 bed hospital because it is constantly losing money. A family terrorized when four masked men armed with guns stormed into their West Philadelphia home. It happened overnight in the 5800 block of Cedar Avenue. The mother and father were attacked and hospitalized. Three children inside weren't hurt. The intruder stole a few thousand dollars and a wallet. There are still some delays tonight at Newark Liberty International Airport after this United plane was forced to make an emergency landing. It was on its way to Houston from LaGuardia when the crew reported a brake problem. Two tires blew out upon landing. No one was hurt. Remember, you can always get the latest on these stories and more right here on CBSPhilly.com. That's the latest for the evening digital brief. I'm Joe Holden.